show. Well, I think team, team, team awesome me. Awesome. When you're in a state, tune in to Team Awesome Me. Yeah. Whoa. Hi. Whoa. Shit. What are you oh, doing? Whoa. <laughs> oh, shit. That's what I thought I broke something. Did I break anything? I don't hold think on. so. Wait a minute. Everyone, everyone, hold on. Just two seconds. Okay, we're good. Everything's fine. <laughs> Thought something happened, and it did. I stepped on a thing, but we're good. What's up? Mike joined with Vanessa, Team Awesome Inc. Coming at you. I'm not going to say it. <sighs> like Cleopatra. <laughs> you can't resist. <laughs> oh, God. You can't stop. It's turned into the catchphrase now. It's such a terrible one because no one knows what it means. I thought there was a different catchphrase. Oh, yeah. Uh, well, suck a dick, Team Awesome Inc. <laughs> you don't have to suck a dick unless you want to, and if you do... We're not judging you. There. It's on the thing. It's illegal. We have to say that after we say Team Awesome Make Suck a Dick. You don't have to suck a dick <laughs> unless you want to. And if you do, we're not judging you. All right. That enough with the lo- slo- really enjoy slogans that. and logos and all that. <laughs> subscribe buttons over there. Go to at Team Awesome Make to subscribe to our Twitter. Follow our Twitter. Subscribe to it. Do you subscribe or follow? You, you follow, follow Twitter. Twitter. You yeah. subscribe to podcasts on iTunes. Yeah. Type in Team Awesome Inc. and that's where you'll find us. It's free for now. Yeah. We're threatening you. <laughs> we're threatening <laughs> you with, with charging you? No. Thanks we'll for tuning in. Money. Thanks for tuning in. So here we go. We got a trailer to react to. Vanessa, are you ready for this? Yes. It better be because this is the Wes Anderson f- new film. The Wes Anderson new film. <laughs> movie film. Have you heard of the Wes Anderson movie films? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think so. Yes, he did Royal Tenenbaums. Mm-hmm. He did Life Aquatic. Mm-hmm. He did uh, other shit. Oh, Rushmore. He did Rushmore as well. Did he do the Kid Grand Budapest Hotel? Yes, that is all. Yes, that is absolutely Wes Anderson. He's fantastic. Yep. Great uh, auteur filmmaker. Uh, this is uh, his latest thing. Remember, he also did. Uh, didn't he do something like? Fox, the Fantastic Mr. Oh, Fox. Oh, yeah, the Fantastic Mr. Fox. That was like a stop Mr. motion Fox. animation thing. Well, this is in that same vein, I think. This is uh, called The Isle of Dogs. I'm not familiar okay. if this is based on any kid's book or whatever, but uh, let's just go into this. Yeah, I have no idea. Guns blazing, kick the door in, say, what the fuck's up, bitches? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> let's just hit play in three, two. Fun. That's right. <laughs> God, thank you. You're welcome. All right, three, two. Fun. <laughs> The Japanese archipelago, 20 years in the future. Whoa. I like it already. Oh, it's stop motion. <gasps> saturation has reached epidemic proportions. Yes. An outbreak of dog flu rips through the oh city no. of Nagasaki. That's bad. Mayor Kobayashi issues emergency orders, calling for a hasty quarantine. Oh. Trash Island becomes an exiled colony. The Isle of Dogs. I don't think I can stomach any more of this garbage. <laughs> exactly. Is that Ed Norton? Out of my mouth. It sounds like Ed Norton. Nobody's giving up around here, and don't you forget it, ever. You're Rex. You're King. You're Duke. You're Boss. I'm Chief. We're a pack of scary, indestructible alpha dogs. Atari Kobayashi, you heroically hijacked a junior turboprop XJ750 and what? flew it to the island what? because of your dog. Oh. Darn it. I've got a crush on you. We get the idea. You were looking for your lost dog spots. Does anybody know it? No. no. Uh-uh. I've lost all my pride. Spots, if he's alive, may very well be living even at this moment as a captive prisoner. What? Somebody is up to something. Will you help him? The little pilot. Why should I? Because he's a 12-year-old boy. Dogs love those. We'll find him. Wherever he is, if he's alive, we'll find your dog. Whoa, this is very heavy shit. Yeah. It's gonna be a fight. I wish somebody spoke his language. <laughs> That's great. That's Jeff Goldblum, by the way. That voice. Oh, Jeff Goldblum. I knew I was trying to figure it out. I know, right? 
a long rickety causeway over a noxious sludge marsh leading to a radioactive landfill <laughs> polluted by toxic chemical garbage. That's our destination. Great. Got it. Get ready to jump. <laughs> 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 Brian Cranston. Nice. Bill, Bill Murray. Murray. Of course, Bill Murray. Always works with uh, Jeff Goldblum. Um, awesome. Okay, Great it was cast. Edward Norton. Okay. Yeah, yeah, totally Ed Norton. I know my voices. <laughs> I know my voices. What? I know my voices. I'm going to turn into a song. Uh, someone dubstep that later. Uh, get that done in the comments below. Guys, this looks great. This does look this great. It looks, looks sad. Well, he's trying kind to find of. his dog, but in the process, he gained five dog friends. Yeah. And the and so there's the silver lining there. Yeah, um, that's true. Let's uh, so first initial reactions. This looks. I think this looks great. It does look a little sad. Yeah. But I th I love the style of it, and I think it looks cool. I actually am really looking forward to this. I didn't see the Fantastic Mr. Fox. Neither did, did I. I saw parts of it. But this makes me want to see it just so I can get an idea of where he's going because he seems to not want to do CGI or 3D animation. He does 3D, but it's with, they call them uh, wire frame things. They just do stop motion animation with them. So oh, it's okay. like, yeah. So he kind of works with these, uh, like I guess they're like puppets to an extent. I think it's great. I think it's really cool stuff. I think it's really cool shit. I, I, I want to see the fantastic Mr. Fox now based on this trailer. And I definitely want to see Isle of Dogs. I love Wes Anderson and he seems to be going down this sort of Tim Burton sort of route doing stop motion bit, animation yeah. instead of instead of the 3D animated stuff like Pixar or whatever which I think is cool because you know that's that's still visually pleasing it's uh it's an art in and of itself but that's my first thought what do you think yeah no I I think it looks really good like I said I think it looks a little sad but I'm a sap so no I think it looked great I was just I was excited about it which hasn't happened in a fur trailer in a while especially like kids I don't I don't know if it's a kids movie necessarily yeah. it might just be an animated but adult movie think, but yeah I think it, it, it might be a little bit of both yeah I think somewhere in the middle be, yeah well we kind of talked about what we liked about it already mm -hmm. I guess we can talk about what we don't like about it I mean it might be slow and hard to follow at times yeah it might be a little pedantic but then again with the Wes Anderson films you get really hyper stylized story Storytelling. It's really mm -hmm. cool. Everything is sort of done in these sort of um, like uh, single shot frames. It's like this sort of wide pan single shot frame that he does. Is sort yeah. of, and then the action happens. Like it's on a stage. Like I could see Wes Anderson directing stage plays. I don't know if he does. Uh, Wes Anderson, if you don't direct for the stage, you should. <laughs> you totally would be a great uh, stage director. Other than that, I think he should direct something on Broadway. <laughs> That'd be fucking awesome. I agree with that. That do would it. be great. Can do you a Wes Anderson. A Wes Anderson. Do a musical. musical? Do a musical of Wes <laughs> oh Anderson. Oh my God. Uh, don't. Do, don't be a bitch. Do a music. Sorry. <laughs> don't, be a <laughs> don't be a bitch and do a musical, Wes Anderson. <laughs> but yeah, this I think this looks good. I'm looking forward to the Isle of Dogs, even though it's a bit sad. So that's what I liked about it. All the stop motion animation, old school filmmaking. I think it's great. It's great. It looks great. Yeah. No, it was like a nostalgia train to the face with those movies. It reminded yes. me of the the. Oh, what is the one with the the chicken? <laughs> oh right. Yes. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. Yes. The chicken and the farmer. Yes. And they the do chicken stuff. and the farmer. <laughs> <laughs> Remember that movie, The Chicken and the Farmer? No, I know what you mean. It was like uh, they were escaping or whatever from the farm. I'll remember it later, I'm sure. I can't remember it right now. In the comments below, people are going to be like, I know what the chicken and the farmer thing is. I don't Maybe know what she's talking about. You don't, <laughs> don't know. know. You, you don't even know. I, I think I know what you mean. It's like the same people do Wallace and Gromit. No, like, that's exactly what it was. Yeah, a dog. Ah, God. <laughs> it scared me. But it's the same people that did a chi chicken run. You're thinking of chicken run. Yeah. That's, yes. yes. So that's they that's were that's trying to escape from the farm. I was, no, I was thinking How of How the and Gromit. fuck did I remember that? Anyway, so what do we think? It's about the Isle of Dogs. It's pretty obvious. Kid's trying to get to his dog. There yeah. you go. That's the plot. Yep. What else, What more do you need? Well, I don't understand why the dogs are being like quarantined. I mean, I do, but at the same time, I don't. So well, because they're dying, that. but we don't know why. That's really sad. It's sad. Okay. Sad. Let's see. So that's what we think it's about. Let's rate it. Let's rate the trailer out of five dead ducks. No, oh, <laughs> oh, no. no, no. I don't want out of five dead dogs. Out of five dead puppy dogs. No, <laughs> sorry. I'll Why stop. are you mean? <laughs> I'm getting worse and worse. <laughs> out of five <coughs> living dogs that are happy and footloose, fancy free, running in a field, out of five happy dogs that aren't sick and dying okay. slowly, whimpering in a corner, they're not dying. <laughs> five happy, healthy dogs. What do you give? The Isle of Dogs. Four. The trailer. Oh, so you want to see it? You're yeah. really you're really keen on it. I want to see cool. it. Cool. Right yeah. on. No, I I'm down too. I really I actually do want to check it out. I'm going to say out of 5 living dogs, totally alive. Yeah. I'm uh, you know what? Why do we almost 4.5. <laughs> Another half step above. 
You're just trying to one up me now. I, d- I want to see it really bad. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'm, I think I might see it in theaters. Uh, I don't yeah. I don't want to see it in 3D because even IMAX doesn't want to do 3D anymore. That's right, I'm calling you out 3D and IMAX. But I will see it in IMAX, just not in IMAX 3D. I would like to see this done that way. I just think it would be really cool. I don't know if it'll translate, but I think it'll be really cool if they if done right. And it seems like Wes Anderson knows what he's doing in this uh, genre. So I'm mm-hmm. down. I'm down. Yeah, me too. For the Isle of Dogs. Check it out. Isle of Dogs. What, what? Yeah. <laughs> Come on. Oh my God. Come on. You're ridiculous. Get down get down with the Isle of Dogs. <laughs> no. Remember when uh, in the 90s there was a movie and a rapper was in it? The rapper had to make a song for the movie? Yeah. Yeah, I do remember I that. I wish they still did that. I wish like Ice, I mean, I feel Ice like Cube they do. was in this movie. I feel like... And I wish Ice Cube did an Isle of Dogs <laughs> rap for this <laughs> Yo, it's the Isle of Dogs. <laughs> oh my God. They're not gods. That's all I got. You're welcome. Yo, Thanks for that fresh gem. Fresh lyrics coming at your face like Cleopatra. Oh, stop <laughs> me. <laughs> Somebody stop it. Oh, yeah. But it's so much fun. Like, follow tweets at Team Awesome Make. Yay! Team Awesome Mink. Wait, wait. Shut up. Yeah.